Hey everybody, welcome back to Fishing Louisiana. On today's uh, video, we're going to do a product review of a shallow water anchor called the Stay Put Anchor. I installed it on my boat when I built the boat, and uh, we're going to see today how it does on the water. Let me give you a little look at this thing. Alright, this is the shallow water anchor right here. A pole just slips down through here and goes into the ground, into the water, into the bottom and holds the, the theory is to hold the boat in one position, it'll pivot around that. Now it, it has uh, three different options for mounting brackets. This one is the stern mount bracket, they got a motor mount bracket and they got a bow bracket. I mount it on the left side of the motor in case it doesn't work like I want. I can mount a power pole over here on this side. But I didn't want to spend that kind of money on a project boat. So let's jump up in here and uh, take a look at this thing. And there it is mounted. It's got the, I got the better handle. It's got a T hand or just a regular like padded handle. And then it's got this one. This handle's got, you know, a handle grip, a hook, um, it's just better. It's got these little clamps that I bought with it. I got an eight foot section there, and then I got a, underneath it, I got a four foot section. Unsnap it here, let's show you what it does. So you got that hole in the back I showed you in the stern mount. You drop this in and you drop it down and it goes into the ground and the boat will pivot around that. That's what the product says. We're going to get it on the water today and we're going to test this thing out. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, welcome back. Unfortunately, when I was editing the video, we had some technical difficulties and a lot of the footage didn't come out. The files were corrupted. We did a complete review on the shallow, shallow water um, stay put anchor. I was very pleased with the way the product uh, worked. Um, we had one little issue. The boat said we were in about 5.2 feet of water. Um, I dropped the anchor with only the 8 foot extension and the handle on it and we were still drifting so the more I thought about it my transducer is about 2 feet below the top of the shallow water anchor so that would be like 7.2 feet so only 8 inches of the shallow water anchor would have been in the ground under the water here in Louisiana, the, the water has real soft sand, mud underneath it. So we put the four foot extension on the eight foot extension, gave us 12 feet total. And it only went down another eight, 10 inches and it grabbed and we had a, had a real good experience with it. We've, we dropped it probably 15 times in searching for the trout. 